When the uh, second plane went in, I knew it was a terrorist attack. When the plane went into the Pentagon, I thought it might be all-out attacks all over Washington, all over the United States. The Secret Service came in and they said, you have got to go to the bunker. I remember just being driven along, almost propelled along. We had no idea um, where it was safe and where it wasn't. We didn't think the bunker of the White House was safe at that point. A hundred feet below ground, Rice joins Vice President Dick Cheney and other senior officials, all struggling to understand the scale of the crisis. Norm Mineta, the Transportation Secretary, was tracking tail numbers of aircraft on a yellow pad. He's calling out, he's saying, what happened to 671? What happened to 123? And he's, he's trying to make sense of what's going on. My first thought was, get a message out to the world that the United States of America has not been decapitated. These pictures must have been terrifying. And that it must have seemed that the United States of America was coming apart. My test was to keep my head about me and to uh, make certain that people around the world didn't panic. <laughs>